What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to R and R Collectibles. I'm Robbie, and today we're going to open up some baseball cards. We got a new box of uh, '93 Flair Ultra Series Two in, and then we got these are my last three packs of '87 tops. I'm actually glad to be done with these because since opening the entire box and getting to these last three packs, I'm pretty sure that the entire thing was all repacks, which means these have been sorted through. Good cards have been taken out and they've all been put back in. Because most of the good cards that I've gotten out of here have had the little bubblegum stain on them. And uh, also in these packs, they have what I call burnt bubblegum. It's like, it's not just pink, it's got these little brown edges all the way around it where it looks like it has like some kind of stain or something. Anyways, um, don't have any uh, hashtag interesting baseball names like we normally do. So today is just gonna be a simple video of opening up some packs. Uh, we'll start with these three and then I'll probably open like two of the um, Flair Ultra. So we'll start with the, uh, the 87 tops first. We'll see who we get. Like I said, these are the last ones. I mean, of course, I'm sure I'll probably order some more, but it probably won't go from the same seller. So there's my burnt bubble guy. You see the little brown edges. So these are the last three. I won't have to worry about this anymore. Uh, Brian Dayette, which is not a, Hall of Famer or anything, so not too worried about him. Storm Davis got a little bit of it too, but stuck to it. Spring Fever baseball card, and let's see what else we got. Didn't get a whole lot of stars at all in these packs, so. Got the Orioles leaders card, you got Jim Deshays, there's a Tony Gwynn, a decent, that's probably like the best card I've gotten out of the whole box so far. Um, I am an Astros fan, so I do collect the Jim Deshays, although I just pulled that one, I think in the last video, or one of the last two videos. Carney Lansford, John Henry Johnson, Tony Armas, Doug Sisk, Randy O'Neill, Steve Yeager, O.W. McDowell, Lee Gooderman, Tim Leary, Don Mattingly, Bruce Barinel, Bar I'm not sure how to pronounce that, and uh, Rick Cerrone. So, got two pretty decent stars. Like I said, these are the last three packs, and those are the best two cards I've gotten out of the whole box so far. So, I know it is a big set. But still, it's just been it's been pretty bad. There's more of that burnt bubble gum. It's all nasty looking. Looks like something. Most cards out of uh, wax, I mean, most bubble gum out of wax packs, even the old ones, still are just pink. I've never seen these little brown edges on it. That's it. We got Frank DePino, Pirates Leaders card, Tracy Jones, Shane Raleigh, Corey Snyder, Domingo Ramos, Dwayne Ward, Blue Jays Leaders card. Chris Spire, Dave Anderson, Franklin Stubbs, Chuck Carey, Joel Davis, Paul Ossenmacher, Juan Samuel, Karma Castillo, and Claudio Washington. That's pretty much how most of the packs have been right there. Nothing. Anyways, last one. So I'm actually excited to be done with this box. Last piece of burnt bone gum. This one's maybe the worst looking one yet. That is just gross. Anyways. If you get any like that, do not attempt to chew them. I know some people put the old bubble gum, it's like nostalgia, just uh, even though it doesn't taste that good anymore, just to put that piece of bubble gum in their mouth just during the video, but just I wouldn't suggest doing those. We got Rick Manning, Tony Bernazard, Bern Bernazard, Bruce Sutter, Jeff Russell, Mike Heath, Rich Gedman, Louis Agayo, Ken Phelps, he's the one that got the big hit of the bubble gum. Scott McGregor, Eddie Whitson, Jim Wynn, Bob Horner, Lou Pinella, Randy Bush, Bob Welch, Dad Bosley, and Bo Diaz. So, that one pack, all we got. So now, go to a little, something a little more exciting. These are tamper-free cards. Still in the original FLIR package, too, so that's, that's really cool. So we'll open this up. I'll just do two packs today. Um... So the 93 Flare Ultra, we got, let's see, three new Ultra collectible subsets. Got 20 Ultra All-Stars, 10 All-Rookie Team, five Strikeout Kings. Looking for the Dennis Eckers League career highlights. And then, of course, rookies, trades, other veterans. So, let's see what we pull out of here. I'll take these two cards. And we'll do the rest of them that follow the videos. Start mixing them all up from here on out. Also got some football and basketball recently. And I still have a box of basketball I haven't opened up. So I'll probably be putting those on here soon too. So let's see who we got. 
And these are a little brick together. They stuck, they got that high glossiness on them. So they stick pretty, pretty bad. Mike Balecki, we got Willie Banks, a little bit stuck to Roberto Hernandez, Tony Fernandez, uh, Richie Lewis, rookie card. Got Vince Coleman on the Mets. That's kind of cool. Jeff Treadway, Kirk Gibson, looking kind of old there. Uh, let's see, Frank Tanana, Harold Reynolds, Craig Graybeck, Graybeck, Fernando Vina, rookie card, Bloss Minor, rookie card, and Orestes Destrade, Destrade, Destrade. I know I butchered that name. But <clears throat> got a Vince Coleman on the Mets card, so that's kind of cool. Last pack of the break. I have to pull one of them Dennis Eckersley subset cards. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, let's see. You got Dave Justice. Was a pretty decent player back in the day. I'm not really saving him, though. Don Slott. Charlie Huff. Tim Scott, rookie card. Got Daryl Sherman, rookie card. Chris Bosio. Felix Jose. There's Tony Gwynn. That's nice. Manny Ramirez. There you go. I know he kind of fizzled out at the end of his uh, career, but... That's a pretty decent card right there. That's really exciting. Uh, Phil Clark. Hi, uh, yeah, checklist. Not going to read all those names. Darren Jackson, Juan Samuel, and Bobby Jones rookie card. So, not bad. Didn't get much in that first pack, but that second pack, we got the, the Manny Ramirez, Tony Gwynn. Uh, got a couple of other ones from 87 Top. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Um, Definitely hit that subscribe button and like this video. Comment if you'd like to. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.